Hair loss is an embarrassing issue for anyone, but when you're hosting a daily television show, it can be a real problem. Dr. Ashton is here for a PRP, platelet-rich plasma, treatment of injections into her scalp for her hair loss. A month ago, I had my first treatment. I'm here for my second treatment. I looked like a balding man, and it was really starting to bother me. What's involved in a PRP? treatment. You get some blood drawn. We draw up the platelet-rich plasma. We will put some numbing cream on your hair before you start, and then we'll inject the PRP into the areas where you've lost the hair. I'm going to do the frontal hairline, do the couple areas that she wants to do, and I'm also going to do the hairline. And we're done, okay? Ah. Uh, whew. That was a little less painful than having a baby. <laughs> We're joined by Dr. Jeffrey Rappaport and, of course, our very own Dr. Jennifer Ash. First of all, thank you for opening up about this. Well, listen, this... I know that this affects a lot of people. I ha hear this from women all the time. Obviously, men deal with uh, losing hair and thinning hair, but it really is upsetting for women. And I uh, was like the first in line pretty much to try this this new treatment. And I, I exaggerated, it wasn't that painful. Oh. <laughs> I have a low pain and, tolerance. And before we ask the good doctor, yes. are you happy so far? Oh, it was incredible. I've done four treatments. I saw an improvement in, the, in this area and this area, which was really where I was, I mean, look at that. You could see right to my scalp. I started to see a difference in two weeks. Now it's been about four and a half months, and I see a huge improvement. So let's All right, talk Dr. About Rappaport. PRP, right? Yeah, it's so used for so many things. Pla platelet rich plasma. plasma. Yes. How is it helping in hair loss? Well, the plasma has a lot of platelets in it, and the platelets have growth factors. There are about seven growth factors in the platelets. And what that does is three things one, gets recruits new hairs to grow, number two, keeps hairs that are there growing, and most importantly, stimulates the stem cells that are around the follicles to get thicker. So that reverses the miniaturization of the follicles. So really different than any other technique that we've used in the past. Well, in the past, there's been surgical technique, as you're well aware of, and then there's the uh, non-surgical technique. But there really hasn't been a game-changing technique like this where we can see results that are really quite substantial. So as a game-changer, yeah. the thing I always am curious about is the accessibility of it. Is this something that is fairly easy to find someone able to do it? How much would it cost? Those kinds of things that matter a lot to, to our well, viewers. This is one of the best kept secrets in dermatology. There are very few dermatologists out there that are doing the treatment. I really don't know why. The study in the key journal, Dermatologic Surgery, showed that 62 out of 64 people got positive results. It's not going to be so easy to find people who are doing this type of treatment. Uh, in my office, we charge either four to six hundred dollars per session. The price varies uh, throughout the country and depending upon what technique is used. Yeah. You want to know what's funny? When we talked about studies, you know how you know a study has been done and a really good one? It's when Dr. Ashton gets the treatment. Because <laughs> this one here, she knows her medical research. We've talked a lot on the show about PRP yeah. therapy, uh, some of the things it's being used for really don't have the great evidence for other things we do. Sounds like this really is going to be one of those game changers because a lot of people have thinning hair and a lot of people don't mm -hmm. want thinning hair. I'll tell you, hopefully coming somewhere near you, we'll of course have more information on our website, thedoctorstv.com. But thank you. <laughs> Thanks for taking nice such good care of Jen. And Jen, you do look fabulous if I may thank say you. we'll be right back.